Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, man, we're going to take a look at uh, what I think is probably, it's without a doubt, the baddest scamp I've ever seen. Probably the baddest 72 scamp in the country, man. Gorgeous car. Um, I actually bought this car from another dealer who took it in on trade. Um, but uh, actually, I posted a picture of it, and I guess the guy, the guy that built this car uh, commented on uh, our Facebook page, so I'm going to reach out to him to try to get even more information on the car. But I pulled his old ad, and uh, this guy spent $125,000 in four years building this car, and it is gorgeous. It's as nice on the bottom as it is on top. A um, ton of money spent on this car, guys beautifully done um he posted that this car will run in the nines and yet you can turn the key and take it to any car show you want to um looks like it's about there's about 1200 miles on the build again he took four years building it uh somebody commented that uh genetti Ra racing did uh, in connecticut did some of the work and it is gorgeous he said it's a honda red it's like a dark red metallic uh it's got all custom gray leather interior and man, I'm telling you, beautiful. It's hard to pick this car, and it is, I mean, it is just slick. Um, paint's beautiful. You can see they've updated the headlights. I love the shark's tooth grill. It's got the pro stock fiberglass hood. Bumpers have been all re-chromed. gorgeous paint you can see no wipers on it there's not even a wiper motor in it but all the lights turn signals all that stuff works sorry man we missed a little wax chrome and stainless is nice like i say it's not it's not a car you can pick man it's it's a nice nice car and uh you know, I found the old ad he, when, he, when he advertised this car, man. I can tell you one thing. This guy's my kind of guy, man. He's a car guy. He's a no-nonsense guy. I actually read his ad uh, to my guys while we were having coffee this morning, man. We all got a good laugh at it. A little crack there in your paint. This car sits good. Like I say, a lot of money spent on the build. This guy did a nice job. This is a quality pro street, man. The only bad thing, because the weather, we're not going to be able to run it down the road. Drove it yesterday. Car runs out awesome. Uh, there's an on-off switch down below. It's just a hair. Look how straight that thing is down the side. Mickey Thompson ET Streets on the rear. Mickey Thompson Sportsman's on the front as well. Again, little things like this you can probably pick at, but man, that's about it. This car is gorgeous. Beats the ground. It's got a great sound. Those are billet specialty beadlock wheels. You can see it's got strange four-wheel disc brakes. Love the color, man. Glass is nice. This is a uh, 360 Magnum block, stroked out to 420 cubic inches. You can see it's got a uh, Magnum uh, fuel system on it with nitrous, um, Indy intake. It's got, uh, I think it's Airflow uh, Research, uh, ported and polished heads, coated headers, all the internals I've got in there in, in the ad. Uh, you can see it's got the high flow aluminum water pump, uh, water pump, aluminum radiator. It's got electric fans on it. Um, you can see the Willwood master cylinder. It's got a uh, MSD uh, ignition box inside with all painless wiring. The whole front end is adjustable stuff. Um, tubular control arms. Um, I think they're PMT uh, tie rod ends, but it's all adjustable. You can see the inline uh, trans cooler down there. 
It's got a uh, custom uh, power glide trans uh, a power glide automatic transmission with a with a trans brake. Look how nice this car is. I and mean, this is a show car, man. This guy just did a heck of a job building this car. Body color underneath. This thing was rotisserie done, man. Turn the key, take it right to a car show. And I don't think this car's ever been run hard, guys. I mean, even up in the wheel wells, there, we didn't clean any rubber out of it. I mean, I'd say this car's lived a pretty easy life, man. Somebody showed this car, and I mean, like I say, he said it'll run nines, uh, high nines at the track. I don't see, see any evidence where he actually had it at the track, I'll tell you that. A-pillar chrome's nice. I mean, normally when you look at pro street cars, you're picking that kind of stuff. Here, you can pick the mirror. It's original mirror. It just shows a little age. But the glass is nice. Again, new door handles. Most guys just don't go when they build a pro street. They don't spend the money like this to make them this nice. It's got an eight-point roll cage in it, all custom leather interior, new carpet, new sill plates. Oh, I'm trying to think of everything I know on this car. Make sure we get it all in here. It's got a B&M Pro shifter in it, tilt column. It's got a, a Grant steering wheel, um, no back seat in it. That's all custom done. Uh, this is pretty cool. So he's got these hole drills. These clip on here. You know, that one says bye-bye, the other one... I think this says Go Man or something. The other one on the other side. I don't want to fall off. Um, shoot. Sorry, guys. Yeah. Go, baby, go. And these clip in here. But while you're just cruising, you don't, you know, you don't want them in your way. It's got a GPS um, um, odometer in it. You can see it's all carbon fiber, uh, sport comp, gauge cluster. It's all painless wiring system in there. Everything's push button. It's got electric dumps. It's got all ceramic coated H-pipe dual exhaust. Uh, with dumps. It's an eight and three quarter Mopar rear end with a Moser center section and axles, 410 gears, uh, Caltrax uh, rear suspension with adjustable shocks. I think all four corners have adjustable shocks on it. You can see it's all prostrated. That's just a little wax in there, guys. It's all body color in here. 16 gallon fuel cell, which tells you he built it to drive it. Does have the gauge. This is really cool. Twisted T nitrous bottle. Um, I got. I think I've got. I think I've got everything. It's got. It's got frame ties in it. I'm sure, I'm forgetting something. Man, cool car. Beautiful car. I mean, you can put mirrors underneath this thing and show it. Look how nice this thing is. I mean, it is beautiful. I did a heck of a job. Like I say, just as straight as can be. I've ordered new mats for it, so it'll come with scamp carpeted mats in it. Ooh, it is wicked cold, man. It's like nine degrees here right now. Roll bar's nice. You get in and out. Uh, RGS harnesses. Did a nice job back there. Again, the seats are really nice. Got the Mopar logo stitched in, stitched in there. This is all your wiring. So I can do this with one hand. Yeah, everything's in there. All your MSD box and everything. Ah, Jordan, you may have to put that back up. I can't do it with one hand. Push button start. I, think I showed you that already, but. Tinted glass. It's got one little mark on the. I'll, I'll try to remember when I go back around. It's got one little uh, mark in the uh, tin, uh, tin on the glass. Nasty, man. This car is cool. Love the hood. Love the front. I love that shark, uh, shark tube grill. This car's just got a great look to it. Yeah, 
It's showing 317, but they're saying there's actually uh, 1,200 miles on the build. Great oil pressure, tack works. Everything works there. Again, everything's lit up in there. Um, uh, electric dumps, hit those good. That's a button on the dash. All your turn signals work, dash lights work. Well, this car got to be fun to drop it, man. I'm telling you. Again, yeah, everything's on here. That's your uh, 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 switch for your light. Your headlights are on here. Everything's right here on the dash. Yeah, that's your electric dumps. Doors open and closed, just as sweet as can be. No headlights. Oh, we got a light out on that side. I know that light works. There it goes. I know that light works. Yeah, we got a bulb. I, I, I'll, I'll fiddle with it. I guarantee that works, guys. Again, yeah, guys, make sure you keep track of our inventory. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram and our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video, guys. Have a great day, guys.